Hello, Legion. This is Hadrian. Thank you for being here. Let's play some more Civilization VI in our Warrior of the Nile series. A little bit of map glitch in there when I zoomed out. That's what happens with the farther zoom mod. It helps you see things, but when you zoom too far out, that can happen. It can, there, it's possible to tweak stuff to where it, it's a little bit better, but anyway, that's what that was. Let's, um... Oh, Kuru has a trade right here. Yep, just renew that, and that's fine. We're renewing a bunch of our trade routes. This is a new trader we just set up in Iken, and I really want them to take advantage of as much food and production as we can. So it looks like Pazirik would be best. So we have the 336 there. Plus it'll put a road that direction, which is kind of nice. I like that idea. All right, we're going to build a mine there. This new builder has arrived. So those builders kind of showed up in this city at the same time. We were building one and sending one that direction just through movement. And they're now ready to... improve the city around, or improve the terrain around shot. Plus the extra production will help us build this shipyard faster. We'll get production from the niter and from the mine I just built. Claim great person, very good. Great scientist, Mary Leakey. 350 science for every artifact in the city. Artifacts in your cities generate 300% of their normal tourism. Ooh, I might need to wait until we really have a bunch of artifacts. That's a fantastic. Yeah, you counter spy in the campus district. Yeah, let's take a quick look at our great works. I don't think I have that many artifacts yet. There's an artifact, there's an artifact, there's an artifact. Yeah, only have the three so far, so we need more. So we're gonna need to build more archeologists once we have the archeological museums built. And then we're gonna use Mary Leakey after that. So we're gonna have her skip her turn for a while. We're gonna be skipping her turn a good bit because we wanna wait until she's very useful to us. And she will be, it's just we wanna wait till the right time. Six turns away from another settler in Meroe. Meroe is set on food focus, so they're growing as rapidly as they can. Let's see. Napata can do what exactly? Um, I need to check on other religions' influence in my territory. I feel like they still have... I feel like there's still a possibility that some other religions could be exerting some power. Let's get a traitor and Kasser Ibrim. Mary Leakey, yeah, we just need to skip your turn, Mary. <laughs> Sorry, but that's all we need to do. Um, a Monslow, uh, let's go ahead and put them in... We found in the Egyptian city of Akhetaten, so let's go ahead and confirm that placement. We want to start spying on Cleopatra and maybe stealing some of her great works. That's been in the works for a while, no pun intended. Let's found a city here. Bugdam Bush. That's a fun city name. Let's see if I I need to give that tile there. Uh, yeah, this tile needs to not be in that territory. It's not near any cities that can be worked. So, um, let's put you on food focus. That way you'll at least grow a little bit. And then, yep, buy the granary outright. Buy the monument outright. We could even could we purchase the sewer in one more turn? We can, and that'll help. So let's go ahead and go for the harbor district here first. Because that's a way to get extra food out of the water. Interesting. Egypt has a settler here, so they might be thinking of sending another one my way. Which would annoy me to no end, being totally honest. Interesting. A barbarian battering ram. You don't see that very often. I mean, it's not unprecedented. You just don't see that often. Alright, so he's willing to trade. Let's not give away on a Karenina, but I will take the Sorrows of Young Werther. So the AI is making some pretty ridiculous trade offers. Kind of like how uh, Tamiris was making some pretty bad offers earlier. Which is unfortunate, really. It is what it is. I'm going to go ahead and go for, let's see, let's go for Cold War and then Professional Sports. Well, no, let's go for Professional Sports first, then Cold War. Alright, a theater square is probably a good idea here. Ooh, it would have to replace one of my many... Ugh. I think I just want to put it in a place... Yeah. I just want to put it in a place where it's not going to do that. Another thing I could potentially do is put... Um, I could put another pyramid here, and that would give us additional culture. New government type available? That's nice. Don't really need to change policies right now. I'm just going to chop down this rainforest. All right, that finishes the lighthouse. And let's go ahead and 
Is there anywhere in my core cities that needs a sewer? Alright, this is the Great Zimbabwe. Here, let's just go through my cities and see. Because remember, sewers help these cities grow pretty rapidly. By providing additional... Ooh, we can buy an armory here. But it's already being built, so no, we're good. I've already sunk plenty of turns into that. Let's not waste it. Yeah, Dungayo. Excellent. All right, that's going to help that city grow faster. And then in Kostromskaya, I guess I will go ahead and build the shipyard. We need to build some additional wonders, too. We don't have to, but it would be useful. All right, so you were trading with Prokrovka. Why? The extra, I guess, just the extra food? Yeah, let's go ahead and keep that. I want Meriway to keep growing quickly. Let's just have Mary Leaky hold off. I'll remember that I have her, or at least I'll try to. We're going to have her just sleep, because I don't want to keep skipping her turn every single turn. That seems a little bit much. Alright, finally discovering the other continent. Looks like a pretty interesting shape, too. Finishing some interesting production projects next turn. So I'll we'll have some new options. Maybe build some additional settlers, perhaps. Alright, Faras is done with its... Ooh, we could purchase some stuff out right here pretty easily. Let's go for an archaeological museum, absolutely. And then right away, an archaeologist. And if I put you on production focus... Yeah, that'll get it here a little bit sooner. Absolutely. Alright, Dongail, you... Let's also do a theater square with you. Wait a minute. See, I don't want to get rid of either of these. So I'm just going to... I'm going to do the same thing. I, as much as I would get a bonus, I would rather have Dongail... Yeah. See, now I can put a Nubian Pyramid here and get an awesome cultural bonus. I think I'll get an adjacency bonus from both. All right, so that gives the foxes to... The foxes were already in Cena's territory, so now this builder just needs to come further up here and improve some of this stuff. Also, can I buy that tile? Yes, I can. I'll do that rice. All right, Settler has arrived. What would be the best spot? Uh, we've got some aluminum here, some gold. Gold here, wheat there. I feel like right here would be ideal. Because it makes it three tiles away from a lot of... No, then it's one tile away from the gold. Yeah, so it, I think we need to put our first city on this island here. That's that. And can I purchase anything with faith? Yes, I can. Granary. And how about the monument? Nope, not yet. But next turn, perhaps. So let's work on... Let's get a builder under construction. It looks like it's going to take forever right now, but it, it genuinely won't. If I put him on production focus, it'll grow a little faster. I know that looks like forever, but it'll shorten. I promise it will shorten. What do we have? Ah, oh, crap. All right, so Kasser Ibrim was actually successfully spied upon that time. Remove your spies at once. Let's just ignore that request quietly. Friendship with, with Alexander has run its course. That's, that was good timing for that to happen. Uh, let's do another theater square in Kawa. See, once again, I don't have good spots for these. Um, I mean, I'll put it there, I guess. I need this stuff. All right, let's go ahead and return by... foot. Ah! Alright, well, let's see if we can trade for the spy's release. Make deal. Alright, he wants three sisters playing chess. I'm not going to give him that, but I will give him... Oh, wait, he's still willing to do it. What if I take away the marble? Alright. I'm trying not to take too much advantage of the, the trade... Uh, the AI's trade changes right now, I mean, it seems like they're really, they're, they're not evaluating trade options as well as they should. Um, but, but this is just funny. We had an opportunity last episode, I think, to really rob, was it Cleopatra? Like, blind? And I, you know, I, I just didn't want to. Alright, so let's go ahead and move you back to Pella. Right back where you were. <laughs> right back to the lion's den. And, uh, yeah, you can go ahead and improve those woods. Shot is now done with its... They're going to be done a lot sooner with their stuff. Yeah, we need to take Alexandra by the Latmus. Alexander is... Um, let's go ahead and uh, and denounce him. 
So we have a much worse relationship with him now, and we have uh, we don't have the ability to declare a Cassus Belly until five turns have passed. Or declare war, but we will have a Cassus Belly in five turns. We'll have several Cassus Belly, actually. Let me go over here and chop this Rainforest. Oh, wait, no. No, 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 no. We need the Rainforest up because it's going to help with the science. Never mind. <laughs> okay. So interesting. This... There's a lot going on here. Certainly a lot going on. And we have our last trader building right now. I need to put them up in Toshka and help that new city grow. Been a great person. What do we have? Ah, great general. Nice. Instantly creates a tank with one promotion level. I might just use him for that. Because that would be pretty fantastic. And we have access to a new settler in Meroe. I can purchase a knight in Meroe if I wanted. I could also build a neighborhood to help the city or to help the neighborhood grow. Should I go ahead and build the spaceport is the question of the day. Or just build another settler. Let's keep doing settlers for now. Spaceport soon, but... Um, yeah, let's do a settler here too. Kasser Ibrim, I'll put you on food focus. Actually, if I put you on production focus... Yeah, that's better. That's 15 turns. All right, Kasser Ibrim, this is our new trader. Let's put them up in Toshka. And then we need to get you over here to improve that. We actually have a couple tiles we need to improve. Why don't we go and improve that rice first? Douglas MacArthur. So, again, retiring you will just give us a tank with one promotion level, and I feel like that would be handy to go ahead and just have. Excellent. Combat strength versus fortified defender. And then a new settler. I kind of want to go ahead and put this city out here, like we talked about. What could I do? I could put it here. Yep, let's do that. It's going to take eight turns to get out there. Still have four builds left on that builder. Absolutely crazy how many builds I have, given the pyramids and the policies that I'm using. All right. Still a lot to explore on this side of the continent, but we're almost done with some shipyards that will help us crank out more units. Uh, let's just say no. I'm not going to help Cleopatra. We're going to be stealing stuff from her pretty soon. <sighs> what do we have? Your progress towards nuclear program has advanced considerably. Very good. I could purchase the amphitheater outright. Let's do that because I need to move towards archaeological museums rapidly. Again, we need all the archaeological museums we can get. I'm not going to do a theater square there, but I can do an industrial zone, perhaps. Nope, not there either. Man... Heh, it's just not a good spot for districts. Entertainment complex, maybe? Maybe at some point, but we have the, the Zen bonus to our religion, so maybe that doesn't need to happen either. Let's go ahead and do a settler here. And if I put you on food focus... Okay, not that. What about production focus? Yeah, do that. That works, at least. And then... Prokhorovka can't build any more archaeologists, but I can do a broadcast center here. If I go ahead and buy the sewer, that city will grow a lot faster. Let's go ahead and go for the broadcast center so we can get the culture bonus. How are we doing victory-wise, by the way? No one started on science yet. Culture-wise, we are moving up. Cleopatra still has most of the tourism, but we are catching up to her as far as her um, upper limit. Looks like Meroe is once again going to be the best trade option for our new city here. And production option as well. All right, I'm going to go ahead and bring this unit back down because we need to explore along this coastline. And then here, let's get an additional mine going. There's that. And... Uh, gain sources, maybe? Yeah, let's gain sources. Let's do that. Okay, we're not going to chop that down, but I need to buy that tile. That coffee's been in our territory for a while. Also, those bananas could help. We have one build left with this builder. Let me go ahead and bring this builder down here to Bogdanbush, our new city to the south. We need a trade route there as well. Egypt has declared war on Rome. Macedon sent an envoy to Zanzibar. Egypt has been targeted for declaration of war by Granada. So I'm guessing Rome is allied with Granada. That would be my hunch. Let's improve that cattle. Yep, time to improve that rice. That'll help Cena grow a lot faster. 
put you on production focus. Uh, no, food focus for now. Then go down and improve that uh, farm tile. Oh, interesting. There's a barbarian unit there, so we'll take care of that frigate in short order. And that'll be some combat experience for that unit. So not the worst thing. Sorely needed. And then we're going to start exploring around the southern end of the continent down here. Doing all the stuff we said we were going to do last episode. <laughs> El Zimbabwe, or Great Zimbabwe, El Zimbabwe, Great Zimbabwe is almost done. Eight turns away. Refuse. Might finish this episode, because we're going pretty quickly right now. Have some new settlers that are being trained up as well. Aha! So we've met Gorgo. What victories can you speak of? It's an honor to meet you. We would love to sample your hospitality. So Gorgo is here. Ah, map glitching. I need to fix that. It's possible to tweak it, like I was saying, to where it doesn't do that as much. All right, so Sedenga can build an amphitheater. We can't quite buy one, but we could next turn. We could go for a builder now instead. Let's do that. Hmm. Let's go ahead and siphon funds again. I think we have a better chance of succeeding this time. What a grand sight this must present there in we the go. wet season. Waterfalls in every direction. Alright, so there's Uluru. And we're going to keep going around the southern edge, edge of the continent now that we've explored into that little uh, nook and cranny. Nook, cranny. <laughs> Macedon has pillaged an enemy amphitheater. Egypt has pillaged an enemy meeting house. And Greece has built a renaissance ball in Ephesus. So Greece exists. Well, of course it does. That's Gorgo. So we know about Greece. All right, so here's this trader in He. Um, do I want to go ahead and move them out? No, let's let's keep that one going because it, it'll help He grow faster. I mean, that's, that's somewhat a core city, so I need to be careful with that. But as soon as we have a new trader, Bugdom Bush does need some love. There's some elephants down here. We could settle elephants and citrus. Ooh, we could put a city down here. Cleopatra would, wouldn't like it, but might be a good spot to colonize with this settler from He. Best city name ever. All right, Iken, you can grow really fast if I give you a sewer. So let's go ahead and give you that. And then if I could buy the workshop outright, then everything I build subsequently will be faster. Let's do that. Seaport, food and gold. Also factory. You don't need food yet. I think what would be preferable to the food bonus. Hang on. Yeah, there's lots of districts I'm tempted to build here. Let's let's go for the factory first. Put you on production focus. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're still growing it plenty fast of a rate. We're almost done with the Bolshoi Theater. That's going to be handy. Let's... um. Continue that route. And then what do we have over here? Yeah, there's nothing going on down here. We could totally settle this area and have a rapidly growing city with some um, some new luxury resources. We could put the city right there on top of the ivory. It would have access to all this wheat and that aluminum. How awesome would that be? All right, so one build left here. I think before I build that iron, I'm going to go ahead and build a Nubian Pyramid here because that's going to help with the production of the harbor. Yep, made it a little faster. And if I turn that off, let's, yeah, let's take you off food focus for now. And then he can, yep, continue there. Excellent. All right, so Egypt is definitely doing her archaeology thing. That's part of how she's getting ahead in the culture game, and I need to be careful. A goody hut near Egypt that hasn't been explored yet. Very interesting. Yep, you keep trading with Meroe. That city actually doesn't have any food to speak of right now. I might be able to buy some additional tundra tiles and help with that, but... Alright, so that cattle is taken care of, and then we need to improve that um, lumber mill. Cattle will help a lot, though. And that's food and production for that city. All right, so Egypt has a new archaeological work. Egypt has announced Macedon. Egypt, Macedon's built a zoo in Candy. 
let's go ahead and purchase the amphitheater outright in Sedanga and then start building the archaeological museum. Can I build archaeologists anywhere yet? No, I can't. But it looks like we're done with the campus district here. Let's go ahead and start building those. Same here in Sina. That's excellent news. And then this builder needs to come down here as well and do some stuff. Let's see what would be best. I can improve those sheep. Absolutely. Yep. Improve those. Sina is now growing a good bit faster. All right, let's do a listening post in Akhtaten. Unless there's another Egyptian city that I can spy on. Have I found another one yet? No, let's just go ahead and Im improve our diplomatic visibility by spying on that city. And we might be about to discover another Egyptian city with this ironclad. But we should have another spy soon too, so it's okay. All right, I'm going to block this unit in here, and then we can take care of that frigate. Get some experience for this ironclad. Uh, you know what? No, I'm not going to keep doing these deals with the AI where they're giving me their great works. They're, they're not being smart. Your progress towards capitalism has advanced considerably. Good. All right, let's eliminate the frigate. Bye-bye. All right, Meroe. Oh, wow. There's a lot that can be built here including wonders, but we just trained another settler. Maybe a power plant would be best before I build the spaceport. How much does a power plant cost? 2900 Stadium is also good, but we don't have an amenity problem right now. Let's go ahead and go for the power plant. We're going to have another citizen soon. Yeah, if I put you on production focus, you'll be done faster. Another citizen in four turns as opposed to one. And then Napata can build, not an archaeologist. Gotta tell you what, let's go and do a settler in Napata as well. And if I put you on food focus, you'll be fine. It actually builds the settler. Oh no, it's a little bit slower, but okay. Shot requires what? They just finished their shipyard. So what do you need now? Let's do the seaport. You need food. You absolutely need food. If I put you on production focus, you should have get done. Oh no, you're not going to get done faster. Okay. Let's um, improve that oil. I don't think I can. I don't have plastics yet, so no, I can't improve that oil yet. But I can't improve that either because that's out of range. So hang on. If I purchase this tile, I can do something. Let's see. This builder can come out there, and that'll be food for Cena. All right, yeah, we probably need one more city over here before anyone else gets any funny ideas. Um... I think that would be the best spot. Let's put it there. It's five turns away. The AI is going to settle that if we don't. So, oh good. This settler, this settler has arrived. Soleb. We still need more traders. Absolutely. Let's go ahead and buy a granary so that it can grow faster. Uh, screw it. Let's buy a sewer too. Why not? Let's go ahead and just get this done. We're making so much faith per turn. May as well. Uh, builder next. Production focus. Food focus. Neither helps right now because we have so few useful tiles in the area. All right, so this is Memphis. We did find another Egyptian city. Building... Okay, Great Zimbabwe is almost done. That's going to be an additional trade route. That's good news. I don't remember exactly. King Solomon gave the Queen okay. of Sheba all we'll look she it up desired in a second. and asked for, besides what he had given her out of his royal bounty. So she turned and went to her own country, she and her servants. Okay, that's that. Civilopedia. <laughs> I was holding down my, uh, <laughs> my, it's the asterisk key, so there was a bunch of asterisks there. All right, so let's see. Great Zimbabwe did what for us exactly? I know the trade route capacity, but your trade routes from the city get plus two gold for every bonus resource in the city's territory. Ooh. Which is what? There's one, two, hang on, let's, let's take a quick look. There's two bonus resources in the city's territory. So it's not the best, but still, that's that's a good win. All right, so I could definitely build the theater square here. Ooh, I could build it on top of that. And it, that tile is not as necessary anymore, so that could be a really good theater square spot. Let's go ahead and do that. It's been a while since I've seen that. All right, go for the amphitheater there. Let's return on foot. Good, we got some gold from Alexander. I guess we'll have it next turn when the spy arrives. 
Yep, improve the cattle. Oh, hello. Just what do you think you're doing, huh? Alexandra by the Latmus is not growing rapidly. Oh, man. Meroway's production center has been sabotaged. That sucks. We'll still get the power plant built. Bolshoi Ballet is a universe All right. of the imagination. A place of magic and enchantment, beauty and romance. Its many worlds vibrate with graceful dances, glorious music, and sumptuous costumes. All right, there it is. So this is going to give us uh, some additional civics. That's great news. Um, I'm not sure which ones it gave us. We'll find out in a second. But looks like... Ooh, nice. We can get Levi Strauss. Let's go ahead and recruit him. And then let's see what civics we got. I think we got... Uh, oh, we got professional sports. Or did we already have... We already had professional sports. So maybe we got... Um, uh, what did we get? Maybe... We just finished Cold War, so it gave us that one. I'm not sure which one it was, but let's go ahead and go for Space Race. Your city can perform a ranged attack. Yes, I know. They just wrecked my... They're hurting Cook from Skya right now. I'm kind of annoyed. The encampment is just out of range, too. So I think one thing I can do to defend this city... Let's go ahead and move this artillery over here. It's not going to be able to defend against these barbarians, unfortunately. Yeah, we're losing housing because of that attack as well. Not good. Let's do a power plant up in Pazirik because that could help the neighboring cities with production. Uh, industrial zone, probably. Yeah, let's put one right there. Send envoys. See, we can go ahead and get some additional bonuses here. Carthage. Ooh, yeah. Let's go. I didn't know Carthage was on the map. So if we can get Carthage, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> that won't take much effort. If we can get Carthage, we could be in really good shape. All right, here's Levi Strauss. Let's go ahead and get our jeans. So amenity wise, we are in very good shape in this game. Yep. Resume that trade route. And then we need to improve that oil in the coming turn. And I'm glad Carthage is here. That's fantastic. We've got Carthage and Valletta. I just, I can't even. That's it's wonderful news. All right, so we've got a lot more cultural buildings building as well. So let's take a quick look at our victory progress before we end this episode. Cleopatra is doing all right, but again, we're gaining honor. So is Alexander. But Alexander's willing to give up all of his great work, so I don't know how much of a threat he's going to be. Because <laughs> the AI might be doing those trades with each other and accepting them. Like, it's crazy to think of. But, all right, so this is our quartermaster. Let's go ahead and counter spy and put them in the campus district as per usual. Extra production here for Bogdan Bush. And if I put you on production focus, I'll get it done a little sooner. Food focus is where you need to be, though. And I already put that in that territory. So what I need to do now... Let's just fortify you. Let's take this builder and move them up to there. And we can build a, um, oh, we already built a, damn, we, yeah, we already built a Nubian pyramid there. But we can build another one that would give us additional food for Bogdan Bush. And we're going to clear that and put some food there. But let's go ahead and clear this out. We keep getting pillaged, unfortunately, in Custom Skya. That is unavoidable. <laughs> I just got the Emperor's voice in my head, Emperor Palpatine. It is unavoidable. Uh, oh, we actually, this is not passable. Okay, so we need to get out of there. Didn't notice that until just now. All right, well, let me go ahead and stop this episode here. In the next one, we are going to continue settling some of the outlying territories. We are also going to um, try, finally get some uh, archaeologists working. We had one earlier, but we're building more cultural centers, more theater squares, so we'll be able to build more um, archaeological museums. Uh, we're building some more now, as a matter of fact. So we're going to have a new one trained up, a uh, new archaeologist trained up in three turns, and then a new means to train one 
in five turns. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to follow along. New episodes are coming out as usual every day at noon Eastern time. Comments are always welcome. Let me know what you think, and I'll see you next time.